manager at a Kearney Mesa strip club called 10 News upset that San Diego police officers raided his club and then left his dancers feeling violated. 10 News reporter Matt Mendez talked to some of the strippers about what the officers did that made them feel extremely uncomfortable. The mood at Cheetah Strip Club quickly turned intense in a matter of seconds Thursday night. About 10 officers swarmed the club with guns and bulletproof vests, interrupting business for a couple of hours. We've blurred the officers' faces to protect their identities. I didn't know whether it was a bank robbery or there, there was a serial killer loose the way that they had come in like that. The detectives were here to make sure all 30 dancers had their credentials and were in compliance. You can see one of the officers here talking to a stripper in this surveillance video. The camera angle doesn't show it, but the women say officers took pictures of them almost nude. They asked us for our licenses and then took down our social security, our information, and then had us all line up in the back of the dressing room and take pictures. Caitlin Delore is a hairdresser by day and a stripper at night. She has lots of tattoos and says that made things even worse. They made me feel like I was a gang member pretty much and they wanted to document every single one of my tattoos. Manager Rich Buntoni says he's happy to work with police, but hopes they're more subtle about it next time and respect the dancers. It's just the show of force, the show of power was incredible. I mean, we, we want to, we're good citizens. We want to go ahead and be a part of the community. Buntoni says there have been no problems in the last 12 years under their current ownership, and that a similar raid happened once before. Matt Mendes, 10 News. And police told 10 News this was a random inspection and that the pictures were taken for investigation purposes. Police require business and work permits to help officers keep tabs on all the dancers.